Greetings everyone, Jetstrike325 here. What I have for you today is my overview of Random Booster Volume 25. Which is right here. All the Beyblades in this pack. The originally eight, but now currently now is six. I think it's just for doing cost efficiency. Uh, that makes it way easier. But with this, you get two prizes. One, you get Gra Cyclone Ragnarok. Second is Dragoon V2. Then you, then you get another chance to get another Cyclone Ragnarok. You get Death, Infinite Death Scyther, Hell Kerbex, Brave Wyvern. They all look good. Let's go on to the overview. Let's start with the prize. Cyclone Ragnarok. We got its wing gimmick, like its previous one. Well, of course, everyone has a wing gimmick. Let me just show you all on how the wing gimmicks are when it comes to all the Ragnaroks. Except for the rising one. Rising doesn't count. That's when it started to have the wing, not have the wing gimmick, but it all started out with this Blaze Ragnarok. It has the wing gimmick. First time having it, but they weren't efficient. Next up, we got Crash Ragnarok, which is the random booster prize during when Chosey was happening. I think this is a pattern. Two of them are re releases, and also the Rising Ragnarok and the Ragnarok Starter 1, basically, or Starters as well, but these two are Starters. These two are random boosters. Bear in mind, these are the first random boosters from the each individual series. D Dynamite Battle and Chozir. So, we got the better of the wing gimmicks here. We got the yellow. The core is super cool. This kit derives from Crash. Uh, uh, you saw it net there. You get the Giga, which is super cool. It resembles gravity, a lot like gravity. It's a little bit of a strange world, but it's so good. Plus, we got the Never Driver, which is a new driver. And it has a free spin sharp tip in the middle. While everything else is solid. This reminds me of one of my older Beyblades back in the day. We got this one. Evil Befall or Killer Befall befall in the Japanese little fight. Here we got a free spin in the middle while everything else is solid. Look at them. They are so similar. I wish they made a re issue of this one, but in this format, I wish. But who knows. Next up, we got the other. We got the other one. The other cycle that in New York. But we got Nexus. We got Rise. Another color of red, which is good. And we got the armor piece, which is two. Does look cool. Next up, we got Brave Wyvern. This is a long time coming when it comes to the Brave Wheel. We never gotten another Brave Wheel since Brave Val Valkyrie. But now we got it in this random booster and this cool red rubber and black plastic. Looks amazing. Wyvern looks good. Second version of Wyvern. If you want to get the purple one, it's a start. It's not a starter, but a booster. And the random booster looks good too. You could pair it up with. I don't know. Glide Hyperion. The custom that I made. The parts are with them is 10, never. We got the never driver on this one. And we got 4A. 
which was from Hollow Death Scyther. This is your second version of Never, which I'll get to the th what you could make out of this random booster in a few minutes. Here we got the second prize, Dragoon V2. It looks good. I'm not gonna lie, it doesn't boost that often that much, but sometimes it has a tendency of doing that. Ah, all right, here we go. We got Wheel and Exceed. I didn't put the stickers on it because I didn't want to bother w losing the stickers at all, but if I wanted to, I could put them on on the next video or something. But you do put stickers on it. Which is kind of weird for Random Booster to have. I know it's part of the original gimmick for V the V2 Dragoon. But it's pretty cool. You could put the Z plus chip on it and the X plus chip on it. Which is good. Next we got... Hellcub X. We got Giga and we got Wave. Wave is a balance type piece that should have been with Diabolos. It should have been with them. Not Merge Dash. I don't know why we got Merge Dash. We could have gotten it with this. I mean, it's the good color of it. Accurately. You get another Giga. And a week, this week color was from a DVD release on Beyblade Metal no, not Metal Fusion. Metal Masters in Japan, but Bakuten Explosion. Yep, Bakuten Explosion. You do get a DVD release, or it was basically a cool prize that you have gotten in Japan. Yeah, so that's it for that one. Next up, we got Infinite Death Scyther. Cool, green. The Infinite's green. I love the color green. Other than aqua blue and turquoise and teal. Orange and some other colors that are good. So, here we go. Death, it's cool. This is your third iteration of Death Scyther. We got here is Curse Death Scyther from the previous random booster. Not with the gold one, but before that with Hollow Death Scyther. And you also get it with the Hollow Death Scyther. Other than that, we got 1A, which is green. I like... The 1A is green. I love the green on this. And we got another universe. Another way to make another Cursed Tomb combo with this. We got a bunch of these universes. This is That's weird. Plus, you get the clear sword... Sword... No shield, surprisingly. Maybe in the next one. Who knows? Random boosters may surprise you. So, what fun could you do with these bays? Why not make another Crash Cyclone Ragnarok? Here's the six armor, which you have gotten with Dragoon V2. It's in a separate baggie. And by the way, I bought the full set just to make things clear and it makes it way easy to unbox. So I don't want to be frustrated of buying another set. Well, with that being said, let's get, oh, let's see. Oh my gosh, look at this. I found something, a little hazard. Let's try removing the hazard before applying, making Alright, beforehand, let's get this out of the way. Let's get this guy right here. Let's remove the armor. Let's want the core. Alright, the core is could be removed. Let's see. Right? We remove the V2 the two armor. We got the never one from Wyvern. Alright, let me put it right here. We got Giga from the Quebec. Right here. Alright, let me see. Let me remove this very quickly so I don't want to get cut. 
The worst thing you could get when it comes to Beyblade is metal pieces. I don't want to get cut from metal, so be careful. Be careful if you encounter a metal piece on a, your Beyblade, so be careful. Don't want to get chipped. Hmm, let's see. Hopefully that's it. Alright, I think I got it all. There used to be a, a thin metal strip on there. That is a hazard. So, let's put this together. Put this underneath. And put this on the top. See? This, what do you what do I tell you? We got another cyclone Ragnarok. If you don't have this one, if you have if you buy them singly of from a seller that has no full sets or anything, this might be a good thing. If you want to do randomize for fun, then go ahead. Go get, go at it. But, yeah. This is cool. This is another alternative Ragnarok. So overall, what do I think about the random boosters? 25. Buy them. Whether you get them singly like six random ones or get them in a full set of six confirmed you might as well get it this is so this is fun so anyway that will do a battle with these in the next video so be on the lookout for that see ya